Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Okami HD Blind in the last episode. We got through Sasa Sanctuary, found another one of the dog guardians, completed that whole deal in there, and now we've found yet another dog guardian back here in whatever its name is. Hello there. How long are you planning to just sit there? You remind me of a certain statue I saw somewhere. Is that the canine tracker? Have you come to take me back to my master? You hear that, Emmy? You must be on an errand from Princess Fusei if you bear that. But I shall not move from here, for the festival will begin soon. That's right. How soon, though? Like, people have been talking about it since, like, the beginning of the game. You've got to be kidding me! You're one of the Satomi Canine Warriors, and you're ignoring the princess's summons to wait for the festival? Come back here tonight. We need to have a man-to-man -man talk. Man-to-man -man talk? Don't you mean dog to wolf? Okay, so he wants me to fight him tonight. Also, I just noticed there's a... There's a treasure up here, and I can easily get to it. Exorcism slip. Okay, I can use as many of those as I can get my hands on. My paws on. Is there anything else up here? There's a burb. <laughs> just snipe it out of the sky. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, there's nothing else up here. Um, I do have to wonder... If there's, like, any water ability we can use over here on, like, the waterfall. It doesn't look like it. I mean, like, w right now we're just waiting for nighttime, right? Well, also, where's the... The shop was, like, over here, right? Hold on. Let's get on a better path. Is the shop still right over here? It is. I want to see what this shop is selling, because I don't know if it actually adds items as you go on through the game to all the shops. Or if it depends on what shop you're at to get stuff. See, like, this one doesn't have the gold dust. Well, you know, we're gonna need mermaid coins. We're gonna want mermaid coins. So I'm gonna buy all those. We're also gonna sell all of our treasures. Just mash through it, pretty much. And that will give us enough for whatever gold dust we eventually get. I can sell these, right? Like, it's not important. I can only carry one of one giant salmons. Yeah, I think we're good to sell those. I don't... No, I might get yelled at in the comments for that, but you know. I'll take it. Anyway, yeah, I don't really know what to do with my time while we wait for this, so I'm just gonna cut. Wait, what? Hold on. I love flowers. Single flower vases are my specialty. You can have it if you like. Did the, what? Hold on. What do I use this for? Wait, hold on. I, I was looking for the guy that was supposed to give me something for those statues, you know? That y'all were telling me about, and I still haven't figured out who I'm supposed to talk to. This guy just gave me a vase for to put flowers in? I don't... No, like, this is some kind of side quest, and I'm not really sure what to do with this. Oh! Oh, that's what... Oh! Oh, that's what that's for. Okay. Looks great, thanks to you. See, even the Guardian's smiling. Okay. Wait. Does it expect me to grab that and, like, bring it to every statue I see or something? Anyway, it's almost nighttime. We figured out that mystery. Also, we should probably go back into the dojo, shouldn't we? Because they probably have new things to teach us, now I think about it. Oh, that's in stone. We still can't dig through those. Yeah, I don't think time passes when you're in the village. Which is why I'm out here, by the way. Just in case you're wondering. And yeah, the pink does look a little pur purple. Purple? When it's at a certain time. Man, time really passes slowly when you don't want it to. I guess if we can get in there quick enough, let's check out the uh, the dojo. See what's going on with them. See if there's anything new that I want to buy, mostly. Yeah, there's many, many of these statues. And I don't know if it expects me to bring a vase to every single one. Is, is there something for doing that other than praise? That's one of the mermaid lakes or whatever they call it. These leaves are on fire. Oh, there's nighttime. 
Well, that sucks. Hopefully I can get back. Those leaves are on fire. I don't think we can completely take care of that. I want to see if he has anything new for me. Just wondering. Because we have plenty of money at this point. Uh, Spirit Storm for Rosaries. Increase the rate of attack for Rosaries. Press A to insult foes and get Demon Fangs. Yeesh. Okay, well, I don't think I really... Wow, okay. He's already taught us two lessons. How is he still like, oh, this person's useless? Okay, yeah, sure, whatever. I'm not sure I really need that move for the Rosaries because I don't plan on them ever being my main mode of attack. Hey. This is white, so that means this is a bead, right? Loud car. Stray bead. There you go. Like, is there only a reward if you find all of them? Because that there's a lot of them, man. Like, let's look at that stray bead count. Uh, Stray beads. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We have 8 of 99. Oh, yeesh. I mean, I guess we're almost 10% there. Can I not? Thank you. Yeah, the leaves are purple now. It must just be at night or something. I don't know. Please let us get in before it's daytime. I really I need to fight this dude. I guess he just didn't want to fight in front of its, its master. Or its human. I don't know what they prefer to call it in this world. But you know how it be. So what's up, my man? I mean, it is straight black in the sky. You bear the canine tracker, so you must know what it decrees. Men settle their differences at night. Man to man, fist to fist. Man to man, fist to fist? Don't you mean dog to wolf, paw to paw? You're gonna let this punk talk to you like that, Amy? Wow. Let's do it. You really can't say no to a fight, can you? Let's show what it, show what it means to be the new hole digging king. Oh, that's right, because we did prove that, didn't we? There you go. Well, let's start start off with a good few solid shots. Boom, 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 boom. No, oh, he digs. He digs. Nope. None of that. Sorry, bud. No air bud today. Oh, I just cut myself out a carrot. Yeah, buddy. Stop that. So I can interrupt any animation he's doing, right? Oh, I can fall in these. He just peed on me. And that got rid of all of my ink. And my entire godhood entirely. What? So if I'm out of ink, I'm not a god. I guess. That's how it works here. Yeez, you take a while to kill, don't you? Really another... I don't want to fall in it again, so I'm going to avoid that all I can. Nope. It's really just a slash and mash game, ain't it? Yeah, there's like, there's no floral finisher for these, I don't think. I hope so, otherwise I'm really missing out on these, aren't I? Yeah, I'll take a tree. A tree is suffici sufficient. Okay, you've got some explaining to do, flea bag. Why are you ignoring the prince's summons to wait for the festival? I am not the real Hayabusa. This real ha the real Hayabusa died along with Mushi's father when they were attacked by the monsters deep in the forests. I happened to pass by, by about that time, but I was too late. Right before Hayabusa died, she begged me to protect Mushi. She foretold the coming of an evil arrow from the sky. An arrow that would kill Mushi on the night of the full moon. That is how I came to live here in this village. I have been waiting for the full moon of the festival season. Nobody noticed I was not the real Hayabusa, as we are the same breed. The night of the full moon draws near. I shall not move from here. I'm surprised you also just still have the capabilities of combat, like any other warrior would have. My duty is to fulfill Hayabusa's dying wish. I must protect Mushi. Okay, well I'll just take that orb from you if you don't mind. That juicy orbage. Uh, thank you very much. We got the loyalty orb. Fitting. We got a Satomi power orb, Amy. What was all that she said about Hayabusa for to- Oh, it's a she. Something or other about the arrow that would kill Mushi? That's not a very happy story for such a festive season. I hope it's not related to that legend about Orochi and the arrow. I mean, it probably is. It's kind of what where my immediate thought went to. 
to be honest, so I wouldn't I wouldn't hold my breath on that one, friend. Is that a path? No, that's just a weird texture, I think. Yeah, it's not a path. Alright, let's keep moving then. I don't know where they were selling that gold dust. I think that was only in Hana Village or whatever it was. Anyway, uh, so the other, well, let's look at the actual map here, I guess. Uh, where's our actual, okay, there it go. There go. So our other one is in the forest. I mean, I get, uh, don't really want to walk to Gata Forest. We have a, a method of transportation. So I think I'll try using that more often than not. I don't. I, I could just like grind them off screen. To be honest, just grind a bunch of money, and spend it all on those mermaid coins. But I don't know, because it's convenient that there really isn't a proper leveling system in this game. You know, just so like I can do that just for convenience sake for the let's play if I so wanted. So you know, I might do that. Share your thoughts. But, uh, I don't know. Maybe there is a joy to navigating the world as it is. I know Neo Darkrai TV, Ralph, as you all have come to know him. Um, when he plays Pokemon games, he actually doesn't use the TM Fly at all. Most of the time. I think he did, like, for Let's Play reasons, but when he's playing that game on his own, he doesn't. Not even once. Which is an interesting way of playing that I will never do. I can guarantee you that much. Just not my style. Alright, what's going on here? Uh, where's our doggy boy? Well, hold on, it's the dog that we rescued from the temple, isn't it? Every single dog we've seen up, seen up to this point is actually one of these warriors. Oh, goodness me. Oh, really? We're doing this now? Alright. Time to fight. Oh, wow, two hits and you're dead. And apparently I missed. That's fine. Yeet. Yeet. Goodness me. Give me that demon fang. So you probably don't take too many hits anymore, do ya? Ugh. Reminder that I can't... I can't dodge. Where did I get that money from? Did one of the other ones drop it without me knowing? Demon fang. Guess it doesn't hurt to grind these demon fangs, does it? I've already really forgotten what we exactly spend them on. Wait, was it the Demon Fang store that... It almost looked like killing that enemy, like, made the world good. I'm gonna bloom that, if you don't mind. Traveler's Charm. Sure, I'll take it. Um, was it the Demon Fang store that gave us the golden whatever? Oh, that's this guy that was in the hotel, was it? Or was it not? I don't know, maybe I'm nuts. Oh ho, I'm gonna do some shopping. Uh, yeah, you have the gold dusts, and I can buy two of them. So he has a maximum of two gold dusts. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. Well, yeah, I'm gonna immediately use that. Select the weapon to power up. Yeah, immediately use that on the Infinity Judge because people said it was the best reflector that I'm going to get for a long time. So, might as well pop a good little uh, upgrade on that boy. On that bad boy. So, that's the warp right there. That's not the actual dog that we're looking for. The dog is in the middle of the lake. Good to know. Oh, wow, there's a lot of these bloom points I didn't get, aren't there? Well, these ones aren't giving praise, so I feel like these are ones that, like, respawn, right? A little weird. I'm getting them all on the first try. Well, no, that's a treasure. So that's definitely not a respawning one. I guess I just missed them all. Where is this dude? Really? Over here? Uh... He's on... Wait... What? It's this? Deep Abyss. He's not... 
He's not here, though. Is it only during the day? What? What's going on here? Is he in the deep abyss? I can't go in. All I know is fishing. Well, this isn't that deep, is it? I can see the ground, I think. Do I need to talk to someone? What's go- Oh, I'm gonna drown. I didn't even notice. Whoopsie daisy. It's saying the dog is here. Like what? Is it- it's daytime, right? Yeah, it's already daytime, so what's... Do I need to do this at night time, or what? I don't get it. Because we could go to the house over here. Man, I don't like that the map's not telling me exactly where it is. I'm just gonna eat all their food as... as revenge, I guess. Hmm. I could put out their torches. Can I do that? Can I just, like, use the water to put out their torches? Here, let me get a good angle for it. Uh, I can. That's kind of funny. I like that. There's no reason to do it, but it's kind of funny. Do I need to smack the statue or something? Like, what's going on here, man? Hmm... I don't like this. Wait. Is there, like, a... Is there a tunnel underneath us? There shouldn't be, because we're over water. It's not how water lines work. There's something behind the waterfall? I don't think so. Yeah, there's nothing behind this waterfall. I don't know, man. This is kind of sketchy. I'm going to let myself drown, I think. Just so I can get back up. The kid's over there. Should I try talking? I should probably try talking to the kid, shouldn't I? Also, there's Burb. Burb. Eat my seed. It's a green bird. That's the first time we've seen a green bird. We're moving up in life, truly. Alrighty. Yeah, let's talk to the kid. That must be how we're progressing with this. I just sure do wish the the map would actually point me towards the kid, or towards the dog, you know? Still not sure what that nut's for. Like, you're just chilling over here, right? Oh, it's you again. Hey, have you seen my dog, Ume? He's always with me when I'm fishing. He disappeared while I wasn't looking. You don't think he could have fallen into the deep abyss, do you? Do we have to, like, fish him out? The water in the deep abyss has always been a bit murky, but today you can barely see into it and the surface is all ripply. My fisherman's intuition tells me the legendary fish has awoken. People call it Whopper. Mmm. Burger King, huh? They say it swallowed the moon and reflected on the water surface. You don't think the Whopper swallowed up the Ume too, do you? Well, there's only one way to find out. Can't find him alone. Maybe I'll go talk to that lady who's visiting Hitoshio Spring. Hitoshio Spring? Where the heck is that? Here's the Demon Fang, dude. What did you sell again? Yeah, it's your boy. Give me your treasures. Peace Belt. Keeps the Demon Scrolls at bay. Make a cash offering and sleep on this mat, and your wounds will heal. Does that mean I can basically trade money for health? Draws money and other valuables near. I kind of want to want the lucky cat. Builds the astral pouch. Increases godhood to mag. Yeah. I want the cat. I want things that are going to be permanent. Okay. So the lady that's visiting Hikatoshi Spring or whatever. Where is that? Lord Satan, what are you doing? Let's go to the map. Suda Ruins, Taka Pass. Yeah, I'm not getting any... Yeah, I know. I'm not getting anything. I'm gonna go up here. Because, uh... There was the, like, fortune teller lady. 
That is something I'm forgetting. If I do get, like, lost too much, you know, fortune teller. Hmm, the water here is so lovely and cool. Now time to get to work. Where well, here's the barrel. Hmm? Why look you here? It's Kushi. I wonder what you up to here, I'm not saying that word. Oh, it's you, Snowy and Isun. I'm here making preparations for the annual Kamiki Festival. I've come to get water for the holy sake we offer to the gods. People say that the water here at the Hito Hitoshio Spring has divine powers. Oh, so this is what we're supposed to do. We always mix it with the holy sake we use for the festival. That way we can make eight purification sake. Whoa, hold it right there, sister. Eight purification sake? That's eight whole purifications. That's right. It goes back to the legend of Nagi and Shiranui. It was the miraculous sake that they used to defeat Orochi. Apparently, they got the beast drunk and cut off its heads. It certainly smells strong enough to intoxicate anything. Gulp. I don't know if the legend is really true or not, but we offer sake to all to the gods at festival time and pray for peace. Neat. Tell me more. By the way, I was wondering, you plan on filling this barrel with water? That's right, we need enough for all the villagers. So I have to fill this barrel to the brim. But how are you going to fill such a big barrel with water? And even if you can, how are you going to carry it back to the village? Hmm? That's a good point. I hadn't thought of that because Susano usually takes care of it. He can handle the barrel as if it was light as a feather. I guess he's not all talk. There's no way I can manage on my own, though. Well, here. First, let me just slurp some water into your barrel for you. That's odd. How did the water get into the barrel all by itself? She sounds like so cocky. Also, there's a thing for me to dig here, and I can't leave it. I'm going to go insane if I do. We just Oh, it's on rock. Darn. Was there anything behind this, or did I already check back here? I think I may have already checked, and I am clipped into a wall, buddies. Okay, no, we're not. We're, we're good. Oh, yeah, there was a deer there. Yeah, I already checked there. Do I need to put more in? More water? I think I think it's full. Yeah, sure. Isn't it strange how the barrel filled with water like that? I wonder if it'll just keep going until it's full. Oh, yeah, okay. All right, you got me there. Three times, huh? So I guess sometimes you just need to fill things with water multiple times. Just like the... I, I thought I missed on the bamboo on the first time, but I think you just had to fill it twice. Yay! How wonderful! The barrel's full of spring water already. This will be plenty for the holy sake for the festival. Excellent. Now I just have to get it back to the village. Carry it home, but it must weigh a ton. Okay. We're getting attacked. I thought that was going to be that French boy again. What is it? Do you want some of the spring water? I don't think so. Sorry. I'll be getting this barrel out of your way soon. The game is auto-advancing the text, if you were wondering. Did the water just explode? Oh, I guess it's holy water, isn't it? Gets rid of demons, doesn't it? That makes sense. Back, you beast! Oh, here we go. Some real action. Here I am, just taking a walk, and look what I run into. Oh, it's you! Susano! Oh boy. So take one more step towards the lady, and it'll be your last. Oh, there's a few of them, aren't there? The great Susano, descendant of Hironagi, forbids it. D do not despair, my fair Kushi. Susano is here to th save the d day. As he dies. Uh-oh, this looks bad. Look at that. 
I swing my sword in the name of love. Susana style sword of passion. Here I go. Oh, we're doing this, are we? Leave. Uh. My. Kushi. Alone. Kushi. Huh? Susano, watch out! I mean, he's theoretically hitting them, right? At least he's landing hits. Himself. Hey, you did it, Pops! That was amazing! You looked kind of scared at first, but you pulled it off for the lady. Susano. Um, thank you. I didn't expect to see such ferocious monsters here. Are you hurt? Susano? I knew it. I knew it all along. Strange things have been happening ever since then. First that boulder in Kamiki, then that battle with the bear, and now this. My sword is possessed by a strange power. You listen to me, O oh spirit who defiles my sword. I shall not be controlled like some puppet. By the gods, I shall expose your nefarious scheme. Okay, well he's a nut. He truly doesn't think he can do it. He truly doesn't. Gross, wolf spit. The magnificent Isun takes offense. Why I oughta... Hmm? Where's Susano? Where did he go running off to? He left without saying a word. What was he thinking? I mean, he just won the battle. Now it's time to win the damsel's heart. At least he could have stuck around to help carry the barrel. It's okay. I think he's busy with other things. There's no need to bother him with this. I'm sure I can manage on my own from here, anyway. Hmm. What? Wait, really? That sounded like that Kokari kid. Oh, I thought it was going to be another constellation. Is he in trouble again? We better go check it out, Amy. Alright, if you say so. No, oh, finally, our doggy. Whoa, the canine tracker suddenly appeared. So that means... Alright, so we're about to go fishing, ain't we? We're we, we about to fish. Uh, is there a save point around here? There's one right here. No. That's not a save point, is it? No, there's no save point up here. I need a save point because I am ending it off. This has gone a little longer than anticipated. Where is a save point? Like, is there one... Yeah, it's in here, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and save, and in fact... Hold on. That wasn't big enough. Hold on, I can, like, spout, right? Doesn't that mean I can do a spout? Hold on, what's going on here? Yeah, there we go. Uh... Then, oh yeah, there we go. Treasure. Neat. Lacquerware. Man, I, I, I'm i willing to bet money on the fact that there's not a single other game out there that says lacquerware. I'd bet on it. Also, we can put out all these fires, I guess, so we might as well. Well, maybe we can. Yeesh, you really have to get it right on it, don't you? Yo, oh, we're doing it for bones. We gotta do it for the bone. Apparently. Well, I was gonna end it, but you know we gotta put out some fires. Yeah, there we go. So when it... I think when it glows blue... Yeah, when it glows blue at the end of the line, that means you're on what you need to be. Another stray bead. Okay, yeah, that's good that we're finding a lot more of those then. It's really just a case of we just needed more abilities, isn't it? 
Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna end it off there. In the next episode, we're going to finally get this last dog. I thought we were gonna get it in the in this episode, but it didn't end up being true. So yeah, see you all next time, and goodbye.